Hi, welcome back to Kolsky Joe's. I'm going to do a really quick video today. This is the ASNMA CG033. You've probably seen quite a few videos on this thing because it's a piece of garbage. So let me just, sh I've had this for ages. I wasn't going to do a video, but now I think I should just to show you half the issue. So I hunted around when I got this one. This is the one with the 1080p camera, 100 meter range, whatever it is, uh, thousand meter, whatever it's supposed to be. And the new type charger, because the other one comes with an apple. A small thing that's shaped like an apple. But the old type controller, because I knew the new type controller was faulty. So, hope you're keeping up. So, the drone itself looks fine. Build quality, the appallingly bad. Things don't fit properly, like around there, look and stuff. So, but forget all that. The controller binds to it perfectly, and this one does power up if I go down, powers up. Unlike JD, who did his, his didn't even power up. And a couple of other things that won't power up. So this one does power up and spin the blade. But, here's the big thing. It keeps coming up low battery voltage no matter what and will not let you take off. So this is the battery that comes with it. So it's a, I can't remember what it is, a 3S battery, I can't remember what size it is. And it comes with a balance plug here. So, I've charged this numerous times on the charger. So the charger has a little set of lights on it, all the lights go out until it's charged. Watch what happens when you put the battery charger on it. So this is a fully charged battery. As you can see, I don't know if you can see that. At the top of the screen it says 1S, 2S. There's no 3 cell. So the third cell on this battery is completely dead. There's no voltage in that, in that cell. So it's only run and it's charged to 4.38 if you know it's instead of 4.2 so not only does the battery is the battery got a dead cell it's also overcharged the other two the battery charger tells you it's fully charged and all three lights go out so that's the problem with mine or one of the problems now i've not even flown it so i can't tell you if it's got other problems as i say i've had this a long time the only reason i'm doing this video now is i'm about to get rid of it so I wanted to show you before I get rid of what it was. So this is some of the videos on this. All I'm doing is employing people, do not buy this drone, no matter what, do not waste your money on this, because it is utter garbage. It, even if it wasn't for them, the build quality is so bad. Look at the wires sticking out the back, there's no braiding on there. The arms sort of like clicking but where's the position is it there is it there because th there's no lock there but it feels like that's where it should be it's just horrible the camera quality through the app looks nothing special look at the finish and fit on the front fit and finish on i hope you can see that in the camera it looks like it's been cut with a stanley knife look it really is bad this drone's like 120 130 quid i didn't pay anything like that for it but that's how much it is 120 130 pound there's so much of the stuff that's better than this. So if you are looking at buying this, do yourself a favour, go buy the F11 or something like that. Something far, there's loads of things far better than this. In fact, I'd go as far to say everything's better than this. So that's it, quick video. I just wanted to, to buy a beware type video, I suppose. Don't waste your money. Get something better. Thanks ever so much for watching.